Okay, DVR2 Big Six, part one. This is the half kneeling guard press. Okay, so don't worry. We don't want you to, to do the half kneeling guard press with the burly. And personally, I think yet yeah, it is a bit too much. Okay, so instead of what I'm going to do, I'm going to simply uh, lay down a nice steady progression for you to, to be successful doing that, that great exercise. Okay, so our first progression starts in that half kneeling position, of course. And then, so I have the, the mini band wrapped around the front ankle and the back foot, okay, emphasizing the use of both feet, okay, and I'm going to grab the bag from the outside, break it, the, breaking the bag apart, okay, shoulders down and back, and I slowly start pushing down to my feet and press the bag out. The arms need to be locked here, okay, press straight out, okay, again, belly button, engaging the lats. Okay, so what it does here is engaging the glutes, core, lats, everything works together. Okay, our second progression is the actual half kneeling arc press. Okay, and uh, so the way it needs to be done is, uh, is gripping the bag with both hands actively like this. Okay, pushing down to both feet and then starting on one shoulder. Okay, and it needs to be nice and slow, a pose over the crown of the head and the pull down. Okay, so it is, actual, it is actually a push and a pull at the same time. So you can go up to three seconds, maybe one or two seconds pause at the top and then three seconds down. So you go one, two, three, pause, one, two, three, down. Okay, um, so we've got loads of things going on, obviously building a strong foundation to lunging, we've got core stability, okay, and obviously that affects the, uh, the mobility in the hips and the shoulders, okay, and then we can play with uh, time under tension, as I said, like a good indication is doing that three seconds up, three seconds lowering phase as well, okay, maybe spending another additional one or two seconds at the top, and then obviously that builds up over time if you do, if you do like four or five uh, repetitions on each side. Okay, progression number three to the half kneeling arc press. So we're going to use the core strap attached to the to the USB. Okay, and emphasizing more of that lateral stability. And what the core strap uh, brings to the table is actually um, it helps the user to to feel the muscles, to use their feet and even their hands uh, a lot more. Okay, so obviously now I'm just going to do one side at a time and it's also a great way to, uh, to sort of to do that dynamic side plank, which is really the, 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 the arc press is kind of like a, like a side plank. Okay, so obviously gripping with both hands again, pushing down to the feet. Okay, maybe I'll come down a little bit more to have more tension. Okay, and then nice and slow, press it over the head, hold, and then slowly bring it down. Okay, press, pause, slowly coming back down. Next progression, next final progression is going to be a hovering arc press. So um, instead of going up with the weight, what we're going to do, we're going to change the body position and add more stress to the body. Okay, so uh, grabbing the bag the same way as before. Okay, starting on the shoulder, see hovering off the floor. So now I'm lunging, split squat, Split stance over the head, nice and slow. Okay, obviously this is more challenging on the body and brings out more of that frontal plane stability again. Okay, give it a try and let me know what you think. 